Welcome back, everybody. This is Laidups, and we're going to pick up right where we left off. Here at Flat 7, and I think I now know how to get that dude's attention. Let's turn off his electric stuff. And cable pull. If I could pull them out, I'd cut off the electric for both flats. Unfortunately, they are too firmly attached to the meter. Oh, man. Well, now that that thing is off, maybe he'll talk to us? No? What? Oh! It's just a trip fuse, don't worry. I'll just flip this switch, and we're back on. Jesse, can we talk to you for a second? Sure, sure, but not right now. I'm right in the middle of something. Cool. All right, we now know what happens when we do that. All right, uh, what was another thing that we could possibly do? Well, let's take a look what we have. We have a map, a bicycle crank, a rag, and something that makes cats go wild. Oh, I got an idea what to do with that. Oh, there's also a Mitzi. I got an idea how do we to do with the cat thing. Uh, let's go back to the two where the doggy was. Here, doggy, doggy, doggy. Okay, doggy. Let's see. Let's uh maybe use poor oh okay. poor on rag. I think we're getting closer. Uh what did that accomplish? Very scented rag. Okay. Cool, cool. Uh smell? I don't find it very pleasant myself, but I probably would if I was a cat. Use no, I shouldn't leave it here. The cats would hang around this spot for weeks. <gasps> really now? Let's go downstairs to the... Uh, dog lady. Dog lady, that's her name. On her birth certificate. Miss Dog C. Lady. I can relate, because I am Lady F. Dubs. Uh... Use? Okay, no, that didn't work. Maybe if we use it around here to distract her. Use? Nah. Okay. Was well, worth the shot. Well, there's nothing really we can do until we know how to get rid of her. Still not too sure. All right, so let's, uh... You know what? I want to talk to Mitzi. Mitzi, what do you think? So, what next? If only we could get rid of that woman and her dog. What if we show you show her this? Smell? Nope. Uh, okay, so she has no interest in that. Uh, let's go back up to two and one. Maybe we gotta show the rag to the cats, maybe. Uh, there's a staircase. Use no. Shouldn't leave it here. Cats will be in the spot for weeks. Okay, what's like a spot where we can leave it? Press any button. Okay, so if we want that dog distracted, where would we use this? I have no idea. Oh, there's the flat one. I don't think that's going to be... Wait, I think I have an idea. Uh, uh, are we going in or what? Thank you. God, why is this place so weird? The hole. What if we use it here? What and where? Uh. Why is that so creepy? Use here? No. Use that window? Look at. Okay, sunny side of the building. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Use here? No. Use bicycle crank here? No. Alright. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go upstairs and mess with that guy's bike. Because I remember there was an option to kick it. And I want to kick it. Wait, what floor was he on again? He was on floor six. Okay. Two six. Wait. Was that right? Yeah, it was. Okay, let's kick his bike. What? Oh, we don't have that option. Uh, I was hopeful there. Who was in here again? Oh, yeah, it was the old man. I can't talk to him anymore. Yeah, he was already eliminated as a suspect. Nothing really to do with him. We can't really talk to him yet. 
Oh, I got an idea. No, wait, that's a terrible idea. Ah, we're gonna do it anyway. I know, let's also talk to Mitzi while we're up here. Maybe her dialogue changes depending on what floor we're on. Talk so, to you. So, what next? If only we could get rid of that woman and her dog. All right, I got an idea. Switch off. Go to the cable. And you use bicycle crank. Can't do anything here. Ah, well, it was worth the shot. Use this. Nah. Uh, cable. Just pull. If I could pull them out, I'd cut the electric to both flats. Unfortunately, they're both firmly attached to the meter. Dang it. All right. Maybe we can talk to her now that it's dark. Oh, no, he's going to fix it. Hi. Damn fuse. Just keeps tripping. It's like we're living in the Stone Age here. Jesse, can we talk to you, please? Later, mate. Later. I'm really, really busy right now. Okay. You know what? I'm going to do one more time. Maybe his dialogue will change again. Just, like, really fuck with him. Oh, that was a swear word. Ah, who cares? Hello? Come on out. This fuse and me, we're playing a dangerous game. It seems I am losing, but I'm a patient guy. Jesse, can we have a quick word? Sure, sure, but not right now. I'm right in the middle of something. Really? Okay, one more time. Maybe his dialogue will change. Oh, so Mitzi, what do you like to do in your spare time? I like to play the piano and play with my cats. This fuse and me, we're playing a dangerous game. It seems I am losing, but I'm a patient guy. Jesse, can we have a quick word? Sure, sure, but not right now. I'm right in the middle of something. Ah. Well, I'm glad we tried. Let's go back to one and two. So we want to get rid of the dog. Radiator. Examine. It's been off for years. I mean, it's interactable. Use. Can't do anything with that with a crank. Use it. The radiator here? Oh, it was right in front of me this whole time. Come on, guys. The body moved over here. Yeah! Kitties? Kitties? Where no? are they? A. What? Ah. Well, aren't they quick? This dog is making quite a racket. Someone should complain to the owner, don't you think? Definitely. She should put that broom down for a minute and sort a dog out. Yeah. Couldn't agree more with you, Mitzi. Oh, Mrs. Dog Lady. Dog lady talk to. Look, they're not my cats. Who's William? I have to go now. Your dog is making a horrible noise. Can't you do something? Your dog is making horrible noise. Can't you do something? It's probably because your wretched cats upset him again. Poor William. I'd better check on him. Yeah, you should. Uh, doggy. Oh, oh, there goes Teacup. And there goes the dog. Are you sure the cat'll be alright? Please. These cats can easily outrun some old mutt. Couldn't agree more. Oh, you know what? Mitzi, come here, girl. Do you think you can unlock this mailbox? I think I can most certainly unlock this mailbox. Then do it quickly. Someone can come in any minute. All right. What are we gonna get? With the math locksmith. Uh huh. Really? Could you step away towards the stairs and turn around, please? I'm starting to feel like she might be tricking me. That she's not really a master locksmith. 
master criminal, if anything. Then again, if I'm not looking, I guess maybe I can't be indicted as a co-conspirator? I don't know how it works in Britain. Done. Here's all the mail. Hide it in your pockets and let's get out of here. It was mostly junk mail and leaflets. I threw those away. Okay, what do we got here? Letter, letter to Pauline. Examine. It's addressed to Pauline Summers. She's that young mother whose aunt lives on flat eight. Uh, can we read it? No, not here. She'll be back any minute. We'll be caught red-handed. Fair enough. Let's, uh, take her broom. Put it in her pocket. And cabinet. Let's go ahead and push that. I'm going to push this cabinet out of the way. I remember there was a door behind it. It's too heavy. I don't think that's gonna work. Are you kidding me? I'll show you how it's done. Stand back. Oh yeah, let me get some popcorn for this. Oh, I'll be damned. Wasted some popcorn. There. The door everyone's forgotten about. Wow. Nice. You're stronger than you look, Mrs. A. Yeah, perhaps I am. All right, basement door. <laughs> Going to the basement. Always a bad idea in horror games. Oh, it's actually not that dark. Extension cord. Take. All right. Coal chute. Examine. It hasn't been used for many years. All flats have central heating these days. Open. It can't be opened by hand. I'll need a crank. Oh, good. We already stole one. Use. I don't know what getting coal is going to do to help us, though. Coal shoot. Examine. It's filled with coal. Dirty stuff. Oh, that's it. Alright, well, now we know where coal is, I guess. Tin of paint. Examine. It's red, the color of blood. Open. The lid is stuck. Dried up paint is holding it firmly like glue. I'll need some tool to, pry to prize it open. Can I just take it? I'll take the tin once I've managed to open it. It's none use to me right now. Eh, fair enough. Sign. Examine. Quiet Haven Hotel? Never heard of it. What is the sign doing down here anyway? Sewing dummy. Examine. Hmm. I think I've got an idea. I know how I could pay Brian back for all that he's done to me and the cats. Brian. The guy from flat six, right? Yes. Brian. That nasty piece of shit. He deserves to be punished, you know. And this wedding dress will be perfect for this. You ever heard the legend of the Cat Widow? The Cat Widow? No, I can't say I have. Well, you're not from around here. But I'm sure Brian knows it. He grew up in this city, just like me. So, what's it about? It's an old story about a ghost cat who takes a human form to haunt her killer. Wow, that's... Pretty crazy, Mrs. A. Do you really think we can pull it off? Yes. Yes, of course. We just need to prepare. A good costume will do the job. This dress, we can alter it. We'll need some red paint, too. Are you sure about that? I promise this will work. And it will give us a chance to check his computer. If he's got one. Okay. So what do we need? Well, basically, we need three things. Tin of red paint. Red paint? There's a tin here. We could use that. More mutilated black the dress. The dress will make a great costume. We just need it in black. Also, it should look damaged. That's important. Cat Widow is a ghost, after all. I'll need some scissors for that. Mask. We need some kind of mask. I don't want him to recognize me, obviously. Okay. Uh, well, let's uh, take the dress. Sewing dummy. Just examine the dummy. Okay. So what do we need? 
Well. Oh, that's just gonna repeat. Red. Uh, blah 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 blah. Blah 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 blah. blah, blah, blah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wall. Examine. Strange. This wall looks fresh. Wait, wait, wait. I just realized we have another letter. Letter to Joe. Examine. Dressed to jo Joe Davis. He lives opposite of me in flat three. Okay. Read. It's from Dr. Frank Zellman. It appears he's Joe Shrink. Apparently Joe failed to attend his weekly sessions recently. Well, well. Looks like Joe's just as messed up as I am. Or worse. Who knows? I should be the last to make a judgment, really. Alright, we got the broom, got the extension cord, got the white dress. Alright. Now I can't go any further, and there's that wall. I don't really have anything that'll break a wall. But we can shove this dress into the coal chute. Make it black. Black is my color. I like it much better now. Yeah, you know what? Couldn't agree more. Oh, pipes! Examine! Water supply for the whole building can be switched off here. There's no need to do that now, though. Fair enough. Stairs. Wait, I thought I saw something else. No. Okay, so there's the stairs if we want to leave. Well, I guess we are going to leave. Up we go. Okay, so I have some ideas on what to do next. Uh, Let's go back to the first floor. Oh, you know what? Now the let's start with the dog lady, cause she's now out of her uh flat. Look, she left the door open. Do you want to check her flat? I'll stay here and keep watch. Good idea. I'll be as quick as I can. Okay, counting on you, Mitzi. I'm hearing a dog barking in my back, not backyard, in the neighbor's yard. And? It's not her. I didn't find anything. No computers, no laptops, no telephone line. Okay, I'm not really surprised. Are you? At least we can now cross her off the list. Alright, it's not the dog lady, not the empty flat, and it's not the old man. Let's go. Alright, next, I have an idea on what to do in this room. A few ideas, actually. I'm just full of them. First, let's try to use the broom to get that statue up there. I'll try to catch that thing for you, alright? Got it! It's a statue of a cat. How nice. So there's another wacko obsessed with cats in this house. Lovely. Oh, please. You make number two. He only makes three. All right, let's take a look at this cat statue. Examine. A black porcelain cat with an open mouth. It wouldn't be out of place in my own flat, but it probably got enough of these. I probably got enough of these already. Shake. It seems there's something inside. Break. Key. There was a key inside the cat statue. What a strange hiding place. What happened to the good old doormat? I see I caught this statue only so you could smash it to pieces. Thanks. I don't remember asking you to catch anything. <laughs> it's true. All right, so yeah, this power outlet here. The socket. Uh, up, uh, up. Uh, sorry, getting my fingers all messed up here. Let's uh. No, not, can't use the extension cord on that? I thought it was onto something there. Well, whatever. We got the key to flat three, so let's just go there. So, I have a feeling that one or both of those people, like of the couple, are dead. I just got a feeling that at least one of them is no longer alive. Alright. Let's test my hypothesis. Ah. Uh, she always does that. Use. Do you want to go in first? Why are all these flats creepy? Come on in. The place seems empty. Jeez, it's so weird. Watch out, Mrs. A. There's a massive hole in the floor. 
Just step around it. I'm not blind. Besides, I know it's there. We saw it from the floor below. Let's have a look around. There's got to be a computer here somewhere. I really don't like this place. Yeah. It's rather creepy. Couldn't agree more. Ugh. Alright. Six, six, six. Bingo. We found what we were looking for. This laptop could be it, you know. Maybe Joe is our guy after all. No, no. It's a disaster. The power lead is missing. It won't switch on. Right. What a shame. Can we go now, please? I think I've seen enough. I don't need any more trouble. No, it's okay. I've got an idea. It seems it's a similar model to mine. I'll just go back to the flat and bring my power lead. I don't know. You sure this is gonna work? I think so. At least we'll give it a shot. Just stay here and I'll be back in a second. Oh god, we're gonna stay in the creepy place. What do you mean, stay here alone? Why don't we go together? I really don't like this place. Just hurry- Why don't we just go together? Why don't we go together? I really don't like this place. You said you haven't seen this guy for ages. He probably doesn't even live here anymore. Relax. Nothing's gonna happen. I'll be back before you know it. I'm an idiot, but fine. I'll wait here. I'll count to a hundred. If you're not back, I'm out of here. I'm an idiot. I'm an idiot. But fine. I'll wait here. While I'm gone, think of a vegetable. What? Why? To keep yourself busy. I bet I can guess which vegetable you were thinking of when I come back. So you're a mind reader now? No. This is just a little experiment of mine. Okay, whatever. Now go. We haven't got all day. Ah, oh, jeez. Why do I always end up in places like this? Well, I think it all started when you attempted suicide, if I'm being honest. Mirror. Look at. Breaking mirrors, I tried that myself. Didn't cheer me up somehow. Chair. Salmon. What a fancy chair. Usually don't see chairs like this in posh hotels in the country. Door. Examine. Right. Great. Three sixes. The number of the beast. He probably keeps mutilated bodies of his victims there. On the other hand, I read once there was some other meaning to the three sixes, too. Something really innocent. Can't remember now. It was a long time ago. I've I had other things on my mind. Can we open it? Even if I wanted to, the doorknob is missing. That is weird. Laptop. Oh, we already know we can't switch it on. Oh, there's a socket. Oh, coat rack! No coats on the rack. Joe probably is wearing his coat wherever he is. It's cold this time of year. It's a bad idea to answer that phone, but we're going to do it anyway. Oh, a desk! Examine. Above the desk, the walls covered with pages pinned to the wall. They look like handwritten letters. Okay. Table. Examine. Disgusting rotten food scattered on the table. Looks like someone made a meal and barely even touched it. TV. Examine. It looks pretty old. They don't make them like this anymore. Switch on? Well, that's my least favorite channel. Phone. Just one big step. Oh, she's gonna fall. Remember the hole, Susan. Uh, uh, what are we doing? Just I just want- one big step. Just one big step. What's going on? She like glitched out or something? <laughs> okay! Right. I'm done waiting. I need to leave right now. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. I don't want to be here anymore. Remember the hole, Susan. What? What's wrong? Let's get out of here. Open. Oh, God. We're going to see Joe on the other side of the door. Damn. Um, the door handle just came off in my hand. How am I going to get out of here now? Well, now we can see what's in the door of the sixes. Mitzi? Mitzi, are you there? I wonder if she could pick a Shit. lock. If there's no door handle. 
Hey. Just one big step. I don't understand why that has to be a cutscene every time. Whatever. You know, I'm gonna quick save. Thank you. And we are going to open this door. God, I don't want to go in there. Examine. Uh, no, that doesn't help. Enter. Whoa! Oh, okay, just a statue. Bathtub, examine. The water from the bath has completely flooded the bathroom floor. Not that I care. I just want to leave as soon as possible. <laughs> mannequin, examine. Okay, a mannequin. In the bath. This guy is nuts. No doubt about it. God, I bet he's a parasite. Examine toilet. It's dirty like everything else in this place. Power lead. Examine. This must be the power lead that was that we need. Maybe luck's on my side today after all. Take. Uh, the, the shadow. Shadow! Oh, he's home. God dang it. There's nowhere to hide. But what? what the? I've got to get out of here. How? What? I I don't understand. What am I supposed to be doing? What's going on? What? Jesus. No. You were not supposed to be here! What? Did you kill your wife? Why did you have to ruin everything? What have you done? You stupid, evil bitch. What the hell is even happening? I'm sorry the door was open. I'm the cast inspector. There were some leaks somewhere. Yeah, that ain't gonna fly. Let's... I don't think we can fool him that we're a cast inspector. I'm sorry. The door was open? I thought you moved out. You took her away, didn't you? What has she ever done to you? What? What? Look, sir, you are wrong. I just came here to find my cat. It's gone missing. Yeah, I see. That stupid cat. I've been looking for it too. The little bastard took off with my key. I'm gonna rip him to pieces. Uh, my friend knows I'm here and she'll call the police. I don't want any trouble, just let me go. My friend knows I'm here, man. My friend knows that I'm here and she will call the police. And I've got a gun. Okay. I can shoot you right there in your heart. Well, that won't do anything. It's not worth it, Joe. I've done you no harm. Of course, you haven't got a heart. Isn't that right? I... I have no idea what you're talking about. I'll just leave. Very slowly. I won't cause you any trouble at all, okay? Oh, we're gonna fall into the hole, ain't we? Yeah, I'm not controlling her. Well, stay where you are. Don't come any closer. Calm down. I'll go now. Forget all about this. Mitzi, are you there? I need help. Mitzi, are you there? I need help. Where the hell are you? I tried calling for help, too. No one ever comes. Just the devil. You are seriously freaking me out now. Tell cops all about the devil. I'm out of here. Get back here right now and give me that blasted key! Oh, we're so gonna fall. Yep, yep. Good thing we can't die! Came through here, devil. 
Well, ain't that nice. Always good to meet the neighbors, huh? Ugh. I might as well just end the video here. Oh boy, I get more and more confused every second with this. Alright. Thank you all so much for watching. Later.